All right, this is for the people that ask me how to put their BBC on their Fire Stick. Um, so we're going to go over here. And you'll probably see me flip between multiple screens. Don't worry about that. You probably ain't got half this stuff. It's because there's more than one computer attached to it, as well as the Fire Stick. So we'll go over here. Hopefully this is clear enough for you. Right, so as you can see, normal Fire Stick. Go all the way back to the beginning. First thing you need to do is go on the top here and go to settings. Flick down a bit and come across the bottom here until you get to device. And you need to put it in developer mode. So you go down here, developer options, enable ABD over the network. Make sure ADB is on and apps from unknown sources because they won't let you install this stuff otherwise. That's the first step. All right, guys, so we're back at the main menu. Um, go over to apps on the top, and you'll notice it tries to give you these ones. We don't want any of these. Um, what you want to try and do is you'll see a sub menu here. Go over to categories. Um, this is changed. This is changed with an update because it used to be easier to find this. Click on utility, and then you'll get into the software that is hidden away. And what you're trying to do is get this explorer in here. Now you should be able to just click on that and install it. I've already got it installed. There you go. So you click on that, download it, and add that. You need that. That's the next step. Okay, so what we're going to do is now you've installed the ES File Explorer. I'm not going to do it for you simply because it's a very simple click and install, and I've already got it installed, so I'd have to take it off and put it back on. We'll go to the next stage, which is simply just open it up. Uh, Fintonic Analyze, but I'm not interested. Just click the back button on that, get rid of that junk. Go down the left hand side here, and what you're looking for is favorites. Then down to add. Then when you open this up, what you want to do is put Amazon.com, A M uh, next. Then just give it a name. I'm just going to call that AZ for now, just to make it quicker. Yes, we've added that path. I think I just added it. And it should be down here now. Like a, oh, there, there's Amazon. So we now open Amazon up. And as you can see, the browser's now in there. That's integrated with this. Now, it's going to ask you to log in. Um, I'm already logged, well, I'm not logged in, but you need to log in because uh, when you try to download this, you're not going to get it otherwise. But what you want to do is simply go into the, the bar at the top, the search bar, and put downloader, then just click submit. It's a free app, but it's just going to need you to log in to get, get access to it. Okay, and there's the app. And all you want to do is actually just Add that to it, click on it, I've already got it installed, so it's, it will ask you to do this. Sign in, because what it's going to do is synchronize with your Fire Stick, that you've, you've got this for your Fire Stick. So it doesn't automatically just download it, you've got to synchronize the two, so they line up. But you just sign in, and then set it up for downloading, and then you just synchronize. Okay, so go through that bit yourself, get it to um, deliver it, get, go through that process, it's not difficult. I'm going to show you what you need to do though on the, the fire stick. So we're going to come out of this, press home, go back to the top, and we should go settings. Now, I think, ah, there you go, my account, that's my account, and then just sync your content. Click that, and it will automatically put the downloader onto your Fire Stick. 